from Los Angeles, California. You're watching Connect TV. Mike, I warned you, this is a tough test. Anyone who can pass this mock exam should have no problem with the real CAE exam next week. All right, Leslie, David, Angelica, Cameron, and Wendy. Oh my gosh, what is Mrs. Higginbotham up to now? Oh, she's got the searchlight out again. I guess the Luftwaffe has been spotted over Herndon. Come on, we should get back to the exam. Oh, David, is it okay if I sit in that chair? The light over there was bothering my eyes. No, uh, no, Wendy. You can't sit there. Why not? That couch is so much more comfortable. Oh, no, it's not. Just let me switch these tests then. What are you doing? Give it back. You're freaking me out. Listen to me. Listen to me. Who are you? Finally, through the window, through the door. I've been trying to get into this place for eight weeks. He's been trying to get in. It's the gentleman burglar. Let's get in. That's the gentleman burglar. That's the gentleman burglar. I know Judah. You states you. You're completely covered. Nobody moves. You'll never take me alive, coppers. You know, I've always wanted to say that. Mrs. Higginbotham? Oh, hello, Kevin. It's a lovely evening, isn't it? <laughs> Kevin, what is this? First you take my exam, then this guy busts in, we're overrun by the feds, your buddy David pulls a gun, and then she wants to fight the Battle of Britain all over again! He's David? I'm David. Then who is he? I think we've been hosting the gentleman burglar. <gasps> Night. This is all my fault. So you see, Wendy, ever since I saw you at the CAE immersion course, I haven't been able to think about anybody else. If I could help you overcome your fear of taking exams, I thought you'd be grateful. So I made a special version of the exam that I knew you could pass. So this was all a setup? Yes. You thought so little of me that you made a mock exam that was easy just so that I'd be pathetically grateful when I passed it? Yes. You lied? You preyed on my insecurities? Yes. That is so sweet. <laughs> you forgive me? Come here, you big hunk of association executive. <laughs> just a suggestion. Shouldn't somebody arrest the gentleman burglar? No agents, you're under arrest. Yeah, you know, I kind of picked up on that. Kind of let's go. Oh my gosh, uh, that's me. It's my boss. It, it, it's Cameron. No. No! Oh, you're kidding. You're not kidding? Unbelievable! Goodbye! What's up, Cameron? Well, NIH just issued a statement. Apparently, there was a typo in their original press release. Yes, and? It wasn't Argon that made their heads explode. <laughs> it was Tarragon. That gives me an idea for a recipe. Don't even go there. Stay tuned for the conclusion of Guilt by Association.